Hello everyone, hope you all are doing good. So if your DVD drive is not showing in your Windows laptop or desktop, in this video we are going to fix this. First right click on Windows icon, then click on this option Disk Management. Now here you will see this option CD row or DVD row. Simply right click on it, right click on the box of DVD row, then click on this option Change Drive Letter and Path. Now you have to assign a drive letter. So click on add, then select a drive letter. You can choose any drive letter Then click on OK. And here you can see if I refresh this page. Now this is the DVD uh, drive I have. Now my DVD drive is showing. So this is the first method you can try to fix if your DVD drive is not showing. Now move on to the next method. If you are still getting the same issue, your DVD drive is not showing. So right click on windows icon, then click on this option device manager. Now here uh, you can see this is my DVD driver. This is the driver I have and currently the driver is disabled. That's the reason my DVD driver is not showing. So right click on it, then enable your drive and here you can see now it is showing. Okay. But if you are still getting the same issue, the final method, the final step you can try is simply right click on the DVD drive, then click on uninstall device, click on uninstall, uninstall your DVD drive from device manager and after that restart your system and this will fix the error. So these are the three methods you can try to fix this issue. Thank you.